Joe Nicole here, and this is just a quick little video of what Joe found Thursday and Friday at the sales that he went to. Hey, Joe. Hello, everybody. Um, let's just get rid of Kirby Pocket here right away. Right away, Kirby right. Pocket. So <clears throat> I found this um, talking to a lady. Apparently, she was an art designer, advertising person, and she actually made this. There's hardly any of them out there. I talked to a buddy of mine, Keith, that sells a lot of twin stuff, memorabilia stuff, and he said he hasn't seen one of these in forever, and they're pretty rare. And she said they only made just a few of them, but it's framed really nice. It has actually two of the World Series tickets from 1987. Let me zoom in on those tickets there. Ooh, oh yeah, bad reflection. That was a bad idea. And so this is from 1993. Definitely looking at almost 30 years old. Um, and we are from Minnesota, so right. super and, cool. And yeah, Curry Bucket was one of my favorite players that I liked when I was a kid. But um, I paid $20. They were asking $40. And the buddy man Keith says I probably should do pretty well with this. I'm thinking he says he hasn't seen one in a long, long time. I'm, I'm hoping $200. Yeah, I am too. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay, what else? What else? So, we'll get this one out of the way. A box <sighs> fan. These things, Joel. These are the things that make me just cringe. Like an old... Exactly. Old. Okay, okay. Old. All right. Um, it's Edison. And I've heard about, you know, if you can find them, they're worth money. And this is the smaller one. Like, there's the bigger one that, you know, you probably had when you were a kid back in the 80s or 90s or whatever. But um, I paid $3. I actually have it listed right now for about 80 Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, people go crazy for old box fans. And Edison, some big name brand that people... Unfortunately, as I bought the thing, the handle... Broke off, so I have it sitting inside this plastic. If the person wants it, it was disclosed in the thing saying it's sure. broken. Sure. Full disclosure. Yeah. Always full disclosure. Right. At the same sale, I picked up this heat lamp. <laughs> Three dollars. Okay. This sells for about forty-five because it's an old vintage lamp, heat lamp that works. Okay. So uh, we'll see. We will see. Um. We'll go to the jump to this one. Okay, I had never seen these before in my life. They're giant laser disc. No, who know. had these? I, did you yeah, know digital laser discs. Okay, but did you know anyone who had these? No. No. Who knew someone? I want to know. If you knew someone who had these, or if your family had these, you have to comment below because I need to know about your life. So at a sale, I found all three of them, Back to the Future 2 and 3. 2 and 3, everyone. So I have the series and a dollar each. And I've already got them listed for about $65 to $70. Each or? Total. Oh, okay. All right. So right got it. into $75. Yeah, yeah. And I've been finding out that by looking at DVDs, I always look for the weird ones that you've never seen before. Because Gilbert Sullivan, the Mikado, I quick scanned it once I saw it, and it sells for 30 some dollars. I paid a dollar for it, and we might see this in another video of what sold already. Oh, a little right. foreshadowing. All right. Same sale. I picked up this Mickey Mouse tin of a whole bunch of his movies or something. I don't even know, but it, I have it DVDs? DVD, yep. Yeah. Jackie was just here. Our niece was just here, and you wouldn't even give that to her? Yeah, but these are the old Oh my gosh. I forgot was... all about this. Yeah, one. right, you did. Oh, That's it, people. Right here. You caught him on video. He will... He's. I gave oh, her other I, one. You better hope she does not watch this video. Probably. Let's hope not. Oh. But, um, but this, I have a list for $30, and I paid it. She's not. Jackie, you're not even worth $30. Sorry. I'll find better. Oh, yeah. Okay, right. Oh, my gosh. I picked up... Busted. 
um, Stevie Nicks and her some weird, uh, I don't even know, it's got a weird book of pictures of music, music CDs. Right. Um, dollar. So I have a list that already for about 25. And it's a pretty hot thing that people buy. So uh, it's at one sale. Everything was way overpriced except for the Simpsons game that did not have the box or the, the plastic or the manual, but I paid a dollar for it. I've already got listed for close to $30 because people love playing the Simpsons. Sure. Games and their Xboxes or whatever. Well, wait, tell us about all those Monopoly games. What's that all about? Who doesn't love to play Monopoly? Me. I hate it exactly. and I quit every time. Exactly. Nobody does. This is the original, or one of them from the 60s. Oh, wow. Um, uh, $2, and I'm not sure if I got this one listed yet. I don't think so yet, because I haven't checked to see if I have everything in there. But I'm looking at close to 30. Oh, I would have thought more. Hmm. Maybe 40. I don't remember what it was. Um, we got Monopoly Disney. And this is a $25 to $30 one used. So people like the different... Couple of different token characters. Picked up Risk for a dollar, and I've already got this listed for close to fifty-five. I think. 50 well, yeah, Star it's Star Wars. Wars right, of exactly. Course. And almost, yeah, I think everything is there. I just got to grab some dice to add to it, which we have. And then I've seen this one before, but it was missing tons of stuff at Goodwill. Oh. And this. It is complete. All of it's there. Oh, super cool. National have, Parks Monopoly. I have this one listed already for like 30 bucks and I paid a dollar oh, for it. I maybe wouldn't quit that one. Yeah, I would. Never mind. Um, VHS. If they're horror ones, people love them. Do you really yeah. consider that horror? They uh, Just because you're scared so, to death of them, Joe. When my mom let me watch this when I was five, yeah. and I don't like being in the ocean anymore, yes, this is considered I know. horror because this is scary <laughs> like you wouldn't believe. Yeah, you, he can hardly be in the pool alone in our backyard. <laughs> <clears throat> no, our pool might be okay. okay. It's other people's pools that I don't know. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, because ours are treated. So, yeah, Jaws 1 and 2. Nice. They were a 50 cents, 25 cents each. And then Deliverance, which is a weird, scary movie. So, I got those two. I also picked up, um, this is a sun tanning lamp. What? Yes. Well, I, I we're keeping that, I, man. I looked it up, and I, it didn't say what it was. And then the lady's like, oh, yeah, this worked last time. We plugged it in, the timer works on it. And the lady said, oh, I burnt my face so many times using this thing. And I guess you got to have a certain, certain special bulb. bulb. Right. But... They said it works, and this goes for about close to 40 bucks. I paid a dollar for it. Um, at the same place, I picked up these old curling irons. Uh, not curling rollers. irons. Rollers. Rollers, thank you. They're the lock and roll. Lock and roll. Um, they go for about 30 bucks. I paid two. An old... An older logo of the Mighty Ducks. These actually do pretty well for a used ad. It's about $25. They paid a buck. And then I picked up... Um, oh, lots of old trucker hats. Yes, but they are like, like DNR, but these were in Canada. So this is like the Saskatchewan Wildlife Federation Save a Goose Branch Region 4. I mean, who doesn't want one of these? Right? Hey. You could use it when you're I, trying to get I've to Canada. Up, right, yeah, exactly. I picked up a few of these before, and they've sold for close to thirty-five dollars. So I picked. I got you know. Here's a Superior National Forest. Oh, Ducks Unlimited. Team Ducks Unlimited, and then the University of Minnesota Biology Station Lake Itasca. They're old, like in the nineties. So I have never seen this or heard of this before. This is an Xbox Three Hundred and Sixty. DVD player, so hmm. it's, and it has the remote and I have the cords somewhere here in the cubby, but um, I paid ten bucks and these things sell for about thirty five to forty, especially if you got the remote. Single stitch, again it's kids, but it's single stitch. I paid 
25 cents for it, especially Cartoon Network. Looks a little rough, but we'll see. You never know. Right. That is for 25 cents. And always look out for Jurassic Park, Jurassic World Dinosaurs. Yep. I think he might have been free or a quarter. And I think with him alone, 20 bucks? No. No. Yeah. yeah. Oh, cool. Because you can't find you know, you have the newer ones. Right. Well, okay, what is this from? Because I don't recognize that. This is like the Imagine X or Imagine little guys. That oh, okay. I, I don't remember. I have it listed already. I paid a dollar. I have it listed for 20 bucks. It was made back in 20, or, uh, 2009. And, um, it's cool looking though, right? Yeah, you can't find them. So you can only buy them used. These are Air 7 Cs. I've never seen these before. And again, if you see something you haven't seen, look it up because chances are it's pretty odd. And new, these are $200. What? And I could not find the exact same model at all on eBay, which is a great thing because that means nobody's selling them. And um, the ones that were close to this used were 95. Nice. So let's hope that happens. Keen shoes, very odd, weird shoes, a little bit missing, but they're still not too bad. I think I paid a dollar for these as well, and I'm 25, I'm open. Um, TV series is again, uh, the three seasons of The Girls Next Door. Seriously? I haven't seen these ever right. out there. <laughs> no, I quick kidding. looked them up, and I've already got these listed for about 45 bucks, and I paid two dollars for all three of them so that might work the one that got me to buy these was this mass effect this so this is a manual for playing video games because people like to be able to know how to do what they're doing instead of just playing it figured out i had no idea but oops has the poster and if you have the poster it's worth a little bit more hmm. looking it up there's only one listing for 70. I listed this for 60. I thought I had it sold today, and then somebody canceled right away. Aww. So, but I paid 75 cents for each one of these. And I've already got a lot of people watching this one at about $13, and this one is about 10. But, but even we if I still sell money. this one for 60, that'd be great. Right. So, so not too bad. No, not too bad. Um, Saturday was much better with you, but right. That's just how it goes. So a good, uh, a good haul. We're done. Well.